Hello, kings, queens, nerds, and geeks. Powder Milk here, and welcome back to the Cough of Andy and Lele. And, uh, this game is just fucking weird. I'm gonna leave it at that. Okay, oh, I forgot. I gotta click on the actual game because I, I, I forget that I'm dual screening here. So we gotta continue where we left off, which is, this is the last file I have. So... An X, one A crossed over. They don't have notes on all of them. Okay. Note on the door reads two B. There's a new person here. Hey, hold, hey, 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 hold up. Don't you dare come any closer. Who are you? Your neighbor's from upstairs. What are you doing here? Get out. We found the key and thought we might get... Uh, you might want to get out of here. We thought wrong. Get lost. Huh? What don't you understand? You don't want to get out of here? That's what I said. Why would I want out? I get free food and can play games all day long. I live like a king. I hope this quarantine never ends. Wait, wait. You actually... They, they actually bring you food? Of course. Literally anything I want. All I want to do is ask nicely. Like bend over and open wide nicely? Ashley. Fuck you. Get out, both of you. Leave Eve before I make a scene. Hey, did I give you permission to go in there? Fridge is full of food. Well, that was something. How come I get so much different treatment? Why don't I get food? I guess you're not pretty enough. I think she's, you think she's pretty? I mean, wasn't she? Whatever. Is it okay to leave her there after I saw after she saw us though? Probably not, but you go in there swinging your cleaver and she'll probably scream, definitely scream. Then the second warden comes in and shoots us. <sighs> this is hopeless. I think our best bet is to finish the ritual to uh, use it to get rid of the second warden. Well, if I can get this woman up to the cultist room, we got uh, as a soul to offer. How on earth are you going to convince her lazy ass to even leave her room? Beats me. Just finish setting up the ritual for now. All right. Do you really think I'm not pretty enough? Oh, come on! So, oh, I am ugly and I shouldn't even be fed. Or maybe they don't. They th didn't think sh it'd be fun to screw you while I I'm loitering around the house. Oh, yeah. Okay, fair point. And I wouldn't let them anyway. All right, so we're gonna have to go upstairs to the fourth floor. Useless. I don't know. At least they're right here if the other one tried to contact this one, which indicates time is running out of us. Big deal. At this point, we're screwed anyway. Hey, what if we call the warden over with the, and have the demon eat his soul? That's not a bad idea, actually. Two birds, one stone. Though he'll come in and guns blazing. Oh, right. Yeah, let me think. Got walkie-talkie. Well, 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 you're at it. I'll be all ready the ritual for us. What do I need to do? I don't remember. Check at the guidebook. I need to be finished the ritual setup. Draw some runes on the floor with blood. Be not sure what runes though. I'll just redraw what the guy had already drawn. It seems to work. You dip your your digits in the warrant. 
Wounds, wounds. Got some blood. I have an idea. Oh. Let's have the lady from the downstairs lure the warden up here with the walkie-talkie. How are you going to make her do that? I don't know. Oh, how? All right, then let's go convince her. Or else there's something else that would still need to be set up. Just us lighting the candles and turning on, on, on the audio. But I think it's best to do that once the warden is on his way. Yeah, I wouldn't want to keep the demon waiting. Third floor. You two again? Sorry, sorry. There's one last thing I forgot to ask you. What? I thought I made myself clear. Well, what do you want? Hey, get off me. Huh? What's going to happen now is that you'll clue into this walkie-talkie. Tell them you want to, his friend are, you and his friend are looking for a good time over room 405. I don't understand. I only need you to understand we'll slit your throat if you don't pay, play nice. No, no, please, I'll do it. Tell him, I'll tell him anything. We'll see. You press the walkie-talkie on. Hello? Now who's there? Hi, Dave, it's me. Where's Malcolm? Uh, Malcolm's here, here with me in room 405. Uh, do you care for a quick visit? Quick visit, huh? I mean, if you want to have a good time, that is. Well, I'll be. I'm always up for a good time, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Was it room 405? I guess that weirdo really croaked. Huh? Uh, yeah, nothing. I'll be there, sweet cheeks. You cut the conversation there. All right, good. Let's go. I'll go. I'll go over for now. What do you think she'll do? I won't do anything. I promise. Go finish it. I'll keep her quiet until it's done. All right, get going, dumbass. What? Fine. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Lay lay catch. She throws you something. Got lighter. You hurry up back to finish the ritual. Hold on, I need to, before I continue, I need to go check something, because I'm hearing noises in the other room. Sophie, what are you doing? You're not doing anything to shoot? Sorry about that. All right, let's go finish the ritual. Yes. Oh, I swear. I can't see. Are you asking my name, human? Uh, what do you offer? Thanks. Did I mess up? I want to go play. I don't want to pay for his name. I'm here. It's kind of dark, huh? Doing this with a kind of easy gun. Shocked, the warden reaches for his gun. Him. I offer him. What the? So, uh, well, how is it? He went with the our colored soul. I give you this. You got an identifiable small object. Hold her for an occasional, uh, uh, lacrant dream. To ga ga gauge the trouble's head. Thank you. 
The entity has left. You are still alive, unlike the other either of the wardens. Well, that that all happened too a too fast. In the end, I didn't get his name, nor I asked for a favor. It just did whatever I wanted. It what? And it definitely just gave me whatever trap Ash was lying around in the demon's pockets. But no matter, the warrant is dead, and if we... I ha ha have even more of a clairvoyant... Dr one clairvoyant dream, that would be cool as hell. You decided not to linger, and the fact your soul is apparently a viscous pitch black mess. Guess you already knew that. Second floor key, got gun. Uh, last, ah, time to shoot Andy. Just kidding. Let's probably shoot the lady first, though. Third floor. Let's go get Andy. Sadly, your plans of splattering the lady's brains on the wall have been thwarted. Her corpse already rests on the bed. What happened here? She tried to shoot me with a nail gun. How on earth I thought they were holding her in place? Well, I, I let go. Why? You were taking a while and I figured she wouldn't start anything as long as I had my cleaver. Lesson learned. How interesting. That, that would make want you to take your chances with that. For no reason. What are you getting at? You did say she was pretty. Ugh. I didn't try anything with her. Yeah, yeah, and here I was wondering why you insisted on staying behind. Andrew shoots his load while I, I risk getting shot by the warden. Are you unaware that the lady is dead right now? I guess she said no. Screw you, Ashley. I almost got shot, too. That's your own fault for letting her go. God, I can't believe that what a dumbass you are when it comes to women. For the last time, I wasn't trying to get with her. And even if I had, which I didn't, so what? She's dead now. Oh, oh okay, what makes it fine? That makes it fine then. Good to know. God, I hate it when you get like this. It's, what's your problem? Fucking every time. Every time indeed. Every time some fucking floozy comes around. Yeah, I'm not a, a se element. What's it to you? It's always the same with you. You get to dip your dick in some bitch and the rest of the world disappears. Not true. R yeah, it is, cock brain. Now is definitely not the time for this. I just need... I just need you to get your priorities straight. My priority right now is getting out of here. My priority sh your priority should be me. Blow it out of your ass. I'm not having this argument here of all places. I, no, shut up. I didn't screw the neighbor lady. And on, on that note, I will be, will you back the fuck off from my love life, Ashley? What's that supposed to mean? Ugh, I don't know. It's not like my girlfriend dumped me after you harassed the hell out of her or something. What she told you. What a tattletale. You bet at her, you're better off with that out uh, uh, loose lip whores like that. So it what it really was you. Yeah, all I did was we eat a, out a quick dinner for you. You're welcome. And I wouldn't harass anyone if you would stop ignoring me when I need you. You always need something. I've always ha have some bullshit crisis as the moment I'm supposed to meet up with somebody. But you bloody love it when and love it here or where I can't and as much as take a piss without you knowing. Huh, and I bet you you'd love it if I killed myself then. Where'd that come from? I fuck. What a prime example of you example of your you. Just you. Haha, -ha, you would. You would, I know you'd already. I'm right here. You want on me, huh? Do it then. I can just for you. And you know, I have just the thing for that. Back to your beck and call, just like it always has back then. What? No, screw you, Andrew. Don't act like I'm, a, I'm the bad guy here. I never once made you do anything, but it's always, I don't want to. I don't want to with you. Well, answer me this. What do you want then? We'll see. If you have to listen for the word I said, you know I... Why don't you want to spend time with me anymore? I'm done... I've done nothing but spend time with you for the past three months. So then why aren't we friends anymore? Of course we are. 
Forget this. Can we just go? Just what? Just go. No, answer me. What were you about to say? Say it then. I'm going. No, you don't. What's so bad about me? I've been looking out for you. Isn't that what siblings do? Just stop. What? Talk to me. It's not my fault. I didn't lock us in here. I didn't kill the cultist. I didn't even kill the warden. Which one? Neither. You did. And the demon. I'm all innocent. I'm not armed a single soul. Of course not. You made me do it for you. I didn't make you do shit, Andrew. You chopped the bastard up all by yourself, and you chose to do everything you've done here. And guess what, Andy? Don't. You chose to lock in that at crate. Where the fuck? Where? Where? Blank in that crate. Where the fuck? Uh, choked. Cry yourself to sleep. That to that, Andy, my poor Andy. So, that just came out of your mouth. What? It's true. You chose to do it, and you chose me. You chose me. Me! You backpedaled the fu You backpedaling fuck of a brother. You chose me. You did. You did. Ack! So I guess we're not leaving here together. You can't do it. <laughs> you won't. You can't, cuz the only one you can talk to when you can't sleep at night, and you can't take it. I'm the only one who can make it go away. Fancy that, when you're the reason I can't sleep in the first place. I would like to go now with Andy. I'm ready to go now. Go like Blank did? Of course not. I want to leave this apart before we get caught with you. Ooh, can we go? I like... I'd like to go too, but the thing is you're pissing me off so much right now. And we go we go now, and you'll just throw another fit later. Yeah, I probably will. I'll make such a scene too. Yeah, so I don't know if I can risk it. Maybe I'll just end you here and be done with it. Though if you can come up with a compelling reason not to, I won't. Well, I already said. There are sleeping pills for that. Okay, then, I got nothing. But I... I but I'd like to <coughs> go with you very much. <coughs> if you plan on ditching me anyway, then fuck you. It's not like I'm going to just the two of us then forget... If it's not going to be just the two of us, then forget it. Cough. I don't... Give a shit about Blake. I'm glad she choked. I know you are. No one knows it, it was us, so what does it matter? As long as it's just us, are you saying you'll behave? I'll behave if you behave. Isn't that how it goes? Who knows with you? Though I'm assuming you're getting out of here in the first place. That's right, our quest continues. What do we name the episode again? Andy? Okay, I'm not going to be Andy anymore. Huh? He's so spineless. I hate Lay Lay A like you wouldn't believe. Huh? She's better stay and die here with Andy. So you and I leave. Fine. Whatever that means, it means in practice. I like you, but you're so exhausting. Nonsense. I'm invigorating. What is this fucking dynamic that I'm reading? I I'm reading this off like... God! Let's leave and never revisit this conversation. Yes, I've got the keys to the second floor, so I've also got the warden's gun. I'm surprised you didn't shoot me yet. Huh, maybe later. <laughs> Let's get out of here, Andrew. She is a self she is a sabotaging bitch. I I do not feel sorry for this character. Andrew being the victim here. Wait. We never searched the bedroom. I already checked. There's nothing there. Snooping around a lady's be bathroom, were you? I had to wash her blood off me. All oh, right. Excuse, excuse accepted. Thanks. 
What the fuck is wrong with her? Second floor. There's no note. You can't read the notes. There's a door. Carpet is sturdy. A long, sturdy carpet. Why is it long? Oh, look, an open window. Great, jump. Tempt me not, Andrew. I mean, it is only the second floor. I don't really want to take your chances with that. Damn it, isn't there a rope or, a rope or something we can use to climb down? What if we climb down the window using this carpet? I'm not sure it would be going to secure it, though. I'll hold it. You hold it while I descend. Yeah, and I'll just jump into your arms while you're down. Would that actually work? Maybe if you catch me instead? Hell no, it won't. We got uh, set. Whoa, so what are you doing? You okay? Why is my door open? You know you're not supposed to have my door open. Come in here, but you can't go in there. All right. Hell no, it won't. It won't. We got to set up the whole carpet. Even the window. Leave it by the window for now. Got carpet. Let's see here. We gotta find something around here that would help me out. On well, the fourth floor. You can't have my sodas. I gave you a soda. Fine. Fuck. But I'm taking one of yours later. Got it? I'm taking one of your sodas later. Equal exchange, self. Could be the TV.
if you use the nail gun and the nail and nail the carpet to the wall, it doesn't it doesn't look safe. Uh, there's a lot to do. So there's some, there has to got to be something else. I'm go, I'm going for it. If nothing if nothing else, maybe the carpet slows my descent down. I mean, I guess. Under a bridge or something. Like tools, what you show is you won't pay the tools across. Ha ha ha. Hot thing in wax. If any. Microphone test. Microphone test. Hello. Okay. All right. How can you laugh? It's anything but funny. How can you do anything else but laugh? Everything has gone to crap. <laughs> Keep it together. I am. Let's start by catching a bus. I'm happy. I'm happy to be out there too. And otherwise, I'm a hair away from a panic attack. Thanks for asking. I didn't get to tell you before, but the friend I called while you were downstairs gave me a gift. Do you want to know? Supposedly I should be seeing visions of the future in the sleep from now. But who knows? Well, I hope you do. It would probably be handy when it comes to avoiding certain things. Yep, so we can relax a bit. I keep my sleeping eyes open. But that also means you can't leave now. You're stuck with me. Nothing new under the sun. Stuck, huh, are you? Oh yeah, completely stuck. <laughs> I get on the bus and drive the hell out of here. Vroom vroom, motherfucker. End of episode one. No, fuck you is an option. I know there's only two episodes out right now, but whoever made this game, it's really well done. Are you finishing up what we left for lunch? The consciousness of your action is yet to catch up to you, which is nice. There's nothing interesting in the paper, right? I'm not done reading. It's been a week, and the odds that there are something now and something now are non-existent. Just let me check. Ugh, I'm bored. How much longer can you stay here anyway? You're almost out of money. Technically, I have money. I just can't use it without giving away where I am to the bank. So no money then. I don't get it why they want to check my ID every fucking thing. Like, goddamn, I just want to stay in a, at the hotel. Why do they need to know who I am? I'm paying up front, aren't I? So I don't like, I think I'd bail out of them. Boo-hoo, the hotel is just fine, too. It's really not. I swear I heard gunshots last night. Or was it just the, at just you? I haven't shot anything. Yet. Ah! What? I think I let my gun back in the room. I really wish you'd be less uh, nonchalant about everything all the time. Hey, now, I can't both be constantly shitting ourselves over every little thing. 
True, but let's just get back to the hotel motel before something I want breaks in and steals the goddamn thing. Are you looking for something specific? No, nah, just window shopping. Well, in that case, may I interest you in leaving the leaving me the fuck alone? Okay, that's funny. Potted plant subsist amongst cigarette butts. There's a bunch of cat uh, at call girl ads stuck to the wall. Oh, maybe I should leave my number here. Absolutely not. What? We need, a, need the cash and it would be tax free to boot. Say another word and I'll, I'll backhand you. Sheesh, learn to take a joke, jackass. Learn to make a joke, dumbass. You're, you're so out there that I can't tell whether you're being serious or not. Obviously not, not being serious. We don't even have, own a phone right now. Would you be honest with God backhand me just like that? Oh no, not right away anyway. Okay, a wife beater. <laughs> Why don't you say that? Ha, don't say that. It's only towards you, honestly. Gee, thanks. Add for a coffee shop. It is difficult to imagine the aroma of a warm cup of coffee from trash rotting right next to you. Are you tired of living? Inquires the ad. Ask the doctor if euthanasia is right for you. What is this, Canada? A soft drink ad. There is a new... There are three new and exciting flavors. Limited time only. Try uh, them now or miss out forever. Uh, caramelized apple and cinnamon. I want to try that. We can't afford any nonsense right now. Oh, come on. Just a couple bucks. I don't... You don't... You can have that... Or you can have dinner. It's up to you. Ugh, this sucks. It's limited time, too. Don't. You told me I had my own choices whether I want dinner or soda. Well, I lied. Fuck your soda. Up yours, Andrew. What do you even put me up for? I ask myself that every day. Now, you're not wasting money on this. That's final. There isn't a room for that you're staying at, but thank God for that. A putrid stench lost from within. There's a bra here. The article about the chemical leak is something the city had ever been. The article de uh, details instructions for people in the area to stay home and seal the windows. Hazmat workers will be sent to rescue people block by block. The closet is empty except for... Reclaim your own gun. Though it's not really yours anyway, but whatever. The warden's gun is now your is yours now. Andrew has been rewarding newspapers ever since you arrived. Paper a few days ago, there is nothing worthless written in it. Paper isn't even comfortable enough to wipe your ass with. All in all, a total waste of money. I suppose I should throw these in the washer while I still can. You throw the laundry in the washer. All done. We're, you're welcome. Gee, thanks. I am all... I, I really am such a sweet e-heart. You're so damn lucky to have me. Yeah, yeah. I cook and I clean and I feed... And, and I feast on the eyes. Meanwhile, what do you do? Watch TV all day like a slob. Knock it off. You're not going to be in the news, Andy. <laughs> I should have known. What are you going to do about it, Andy? Gonna choke me out again, are you? Are you? Do you want me to? Oh, come on, I'm kidding. It's all good fun. I thought I we were I thought we were fine. We are. I'm just messing around. 
It's just a nickname. Get over yourself. It's the one thing I asked of you. And it's symbolic, dumbass. You and your romanticism. Shove it up your ass. I don't know what I'm ex is expecting. Listen, I'm behaving. And what do you want? I'll be good, so good to you. Are you? Because I'm getting the opposite impression here. Yeah, yeah, you think I'm so awful, huh? You want to see what it's like when I'm actually misbehave? It could be so much worse. Should I show you just how awful I really am? Go for it. Th though you're going to find me a lot less accommodating than Andy. <laughs> than Andy. And now, now to some less important news. One of the quarantine apartments has been a bit uh, had a bit of a situation. Nothing major, just a fire that burned the whole place down. Everybody died. Yes, everybody. Representative of the Water Company here is with us today. They're here. If there is anything you'd like to add? Yes, my deepest condolences to the family members of the deceased. The problem is that most definitely not a wholly mismanaged mess. Better burned to the ground. Therefore, it is sad. It was sad that it. Therefore, it is so sad that it happened. To ease the status of the recommended try to our oxy soda, we just tr rolled out three or new, three new exciting flavors. Excuse me, sir. Something needs to be going wrong with your microphone. I'm sure er, me to say to drink your trusty bubbly popoly, which happens to be our sponsor. And it doesn't even make your organs bleed out of your ass, unlike some alternatives. Anyway. That was all for now. Tune in later for the whole, more wholesome news to cheer up your day. That was our apartment, wasn't it? Was, being the correct tense, indeed. Did I leave the oven on? It said everybody died. Oh, that's great, isn't it? Huh? They must think we died too and all the evidence of our es escapades. S let's say a, they have been incinerated. I wonder, I wonder about that. <laughs> I told you it would work out. That still leaves us homeless and just out, out, out penny, about penniless. Whatever. Things are clearly going to sort themselves out. I'm going to get some sleep. Good night. I'm going to stay up a bit longer. Maybe the late night news will have more information about the fire. Suit yourself. Good night. As usual, you fall asleep without a care in the world. Maybe we'll get that first clairvoyance thing. Someone has entered the room. Huh? Listen here, you. Against your better judgment, you think Andrew is... All that, but you're not leaving without him. Wake up. We gotta go. Hmm? Get up. I had a vision. We're about to get killed. Now we gotta go now. Do I go that way? The park is the, uh, this way, but there's nothing interesting of that in this hour. So I want to stay here and see if the killer actually shows up. What I do to get deserve to get murdered in my sleep anyway? Might be the bit risky. Stay in here and you don't know which direction they come from, right? Assuming anyone shows up anyway. They will, I'm sure. And so you stand there and wait. And wait. And wait. Andrew's light, lights up the fourth cigarette. Another one? Way to blow money. Blow it out your ass and bored and cold. You're probably cold old because of the crap mess your messes with your blood circulation. Okay, mom. Make sure it makes you up at it too, by the way. It didn't sound like I'd be meeting any girls anytime soon anyway. What's stopping you? I, I said oh, I said enough. Quiet you. I thought you were we were hiding. cultist. Lucky for you, I wasn't the guy you were expecting to come visit, slit your throat, come 
Though I'm sure he'd look familiar anyway. Didn't we eat that guy? Don't say that out loud. Oh, sorry, didn't we chop that guy up in the store or in the fr freezer? Actually, come on. <laughs> Seriously, though, I guess there was more from, from where he came from. Where do you suppose he was off to? Why, a sex and drug party with demons? Why are you asking me? Whatever, should we follow him? But I was trying to see if my visions come true or not. It's not like we both ha have to be here. You really don't, don't want to stand here alone in the middle of the night. But you're also curious about the cultist look like he's up to. All right, fine, you go. But come back soon. It switched me to Andrew. Oh, good. You're not going after all. Uh, well, I am. I'm just... Did you see which way he went? Into the alley, right? I'm now I'm Andrew now. I heard a phone go off. It's probably my old phone. Wait, hold up the door, please. Hold on, I'm checking something. Run, sucker, run. That literally is before the third cultist can board. Ha 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 Curse you, brats. Staff's only, it says, and it's locked. Recycling points need to be doubled to smoking area. Carbon recycling apparently proven to double the graffiti and blah, blah, blah. Mixed waste. Bio waste, you're just eating it. Oh, here, once again. Two unemployment items, one, one blank ink, one clubs. E. Wait, the code is right on the wall, my fucking dumbass. Triple six. The winner arrives, of course. I don't know why I even entertain the idea of being anything else. At least they pointed it out! Like. Oh, what? Who let you in? Sorry, I was. Was I not supposed to be here? Is this the se a demon sex party? What? I hope not. My wife would kill me. What the hell are you talking about? There's no such thing. I do have a wife. No, there's no demon sex party. Oh, well, just a regular demon summoning then. I mean, that's what I was told, but... Listen, who the hell invited you? You're not even dressed properly. Right, right, sir. I didn't know there was a dress code. I don't know who told you about uh, today, but you can go kick rocks. All right, I'll go. No harm done. I can't believe this. There's literally invite anyone these days, huh? It just means six eyes is getting popular. We should be glad. So I'm guessing our neighbor was part of these guys' little club. We're pretty far from home, though. Maybe we'll gather some multiple locations. Can these guys actually summon demons, though? I mean, our neighbor managed to eventually, but... You, de you decide you should get inside somehow out and find out. <sighs> what do I care if those clowns are up to anyway? You decide that you're for the way forward doesn't strike you before, but you're done with your smoke, you just call it quits. And then you just get putting other smoke out. And there's a key under the cigarette button jar. Employee's key. This is the drapiest set of drapery you've ever laid your eyes on. You 
crumpled note of the trash note reads, Stop eating my lunch, you animals. Someone's left a note. It reads, To whoever ate my casserole, I'll have your head on a plate. And the, and the office lies same shit, different toilet. The top layer of full of cake lowers some paper cups. Carp are still plates of cakes and coffee dispensers. What's with the cake? It's a bit late for work meeting. The elevator's coming up. Ugh, this is going to take two trips. Go as the cultist takes one of the carts and the elevator went on with him. Remove the paper cups of the cart. You could easily, surely squeeze yourself with the cart, but now you also seen instantly. You wrap yourself like a curtain goes and step yourself on the cart. Hmm. Shows a piece of cake into his mouth. Oh, Dark Lord, that is good. He carts you off into the elevator. How is this cart so much heavier than the other? Gah, could it be? The weight of my sins? No! Is this really what it is? Like, is this... It looks like a bar, and they're just doing some demon summoning look, casually. Look, there's even a stage with speakers on it. There's a bar over there. <clears throat> okay, be cool, be cool. No one has to know. I've been me and the devil. It's between me and the devil. Just act normal. Did I miss it? Shh. I can't see anything from here. <clears throat> well then, everyone, the ritual is all set up. Now that I know you're all excited about the th free coffee, but first things first, all together now, show yourself, Lord Unknown. This is such fun. Reveal yourself to us, Lord Unknown. The cultists keep calling the, for Lord Unknown for a while. It becomes increasingly clear that nothing is going to show up. Wow, it looks like the amateur, it's amateur, this amateur hour. My Ashley summoned something on her first try, though that's probably not a good thing, is it? I feel Lord Unknown is with us today, but only in spirit. Ugh, I brought the carts down, but someone stole one of the cakes. I don't know who. Oh, can we have some now? Ugh. Yes, please. Everyone enjoy yourselves. Where are your robes? Oh, sorry. The thing is, I spilled some coffee on them. <laughs> Idiot. Now you got all your answers. You you miss Ashley. Fine, you take two pieces. Right? How many is there is? That one's just dancing up here. Hey, hey, I'm on stage. It's like I'm famous. He's actually just dancing. Well, someone is undressed. I was too busy eating cake. He care. These cheap asses offer milk for the coffee instead of cream. Also, the beer sm uh, uh, they sell tastes like piss. Not that I've ever drank piss. Converse. Well, there. Well, did you hear about this gathering in the first place? The cultist magazine I subscribed to ha had an ad. I figured it was going to be lame, so I thought I'd should check it out since I don't have any. I don't live far too far away. What about you? Same anyway. I gotta go. It was nice talking to you. See you next time. What next time? Although I, th though she didn't, s didn't like it here. I thought she didn't like it here. Hey, didn't we already tell you to beat it? Oh, are they done? How about how did the summoning go? Ugh, no. Look, man, you're ru ru ruining the whole vibe with that get up. Yeah, you can't come in here dressed like that again. The whole point is that you don't know who's who. I know. You know what? I think you're right. Shame on me. I'll leave right away. Ugh, good. Just don't let this happen again. Have a good night. They are, they are completely fucking stupid. What kind of secret organization is this? Are you done scooping on the cultist? 
Yeah, so there's apparently a little cultist club where they are all gather around with some demons and treats. But they can't summon for shit. Absolutely nothing showed up. Nothing showed up on this end either. I don't understand. It was a vision for sure. There was like... You hear a car. That's him. It's the guy who slit our throats in my dream. Yikes, you really just went in our room just like that. You still doubted me? Where'd he get the key? Should we just leave? We're supposed to vacate the room in the morning anyway. Our stuff is still in there. What stuff? We sold off, off the junk of you and I hoarding. And I can live without the trash and laundry. Well, like someone pointed out, we can't keep wasting money buying new clothes. I'm not risking my life getting there to rescue our socks. There's my... It's my better bar, actually. It's a new one. Then this new one sucks. Still not interested, in fact. I'm somehow even less inclined now. Scoof. You know nothing of my troubles. Regardless, I think you still ha have to kill that guy. I think we have to kill that guy, though. This is so random burglary. He's specifically after us for whatever reason. Like, somehow he tracked us down, so even if we run away, won't he keep coming after us? That's not wrong, but... Uh, wh why is he still in the room? We're not even in there. Well, if I was him, I'd figured we'd be out getting food or something. And so now he's probably waiting to kill us upon entry. Unli unlikely, since he wants to go oh, about this quietly. Uh, hmm, he's definitely hiding in the closet or something, waiting for us to go back to sleep. Then he'll kill us in our sleep. Just like in my vision, again. You know this, and you know this how? I know because that's what I'm, I do. I know this because that's what I do, huh? Duh. Plus, he's using a knife, so there. Listen, Andrew, just trust me. I thought, thought these things through. The question's not why she's thought about such things. Now, oh, enough dilly-dally. Let's get in there and pretend we, for, we forgot something. Then we'll lure him somewhere air less conspicuous. And then what? You have to ask? <sighs> Let's go in there. Hitman's car. The car is locked. This is the car's car. All right, let him break in. Oh my God, every single person in the premises? Why on earth would you want that? Duh, huh. I thought you wanted to, you know, off the guy. Last thing we needed is an ambulance. All right, cars have alarms. At least I asked before doing it. There's a door here, isn't there? All right, leave this to me. This has got to be the stupidest thing we've done so far. Personally, I think, of sh I think shooting fireworks in doors was dumber, but hey, uh, opinions. Which is, if I may add, was also your idea. I was 12, you should have stopped me. So should I talk to you out of this one, or... Oh, shut up and follow my lead. Back to Ashley. No one has stepped forth to kill you yet. Oh gosh, Jolly Andrew, I've just realized our impromptu night walk is the store has left me parched. Is that so? Let us return to the gas stop at once. Since we wa uh, want to be uh, so quick about it, let's uh, take a shortcut through the park. Or we might follow us about the foliage and shield from sight. What's that sound, huh? Ter terrific, let's go. Not so fast. Let me grab my things first. I just realized I don't I don't trust us I don't trust us the the staff here. Hi so. You doing good? What you thinking about? Uh, nah, nah, nah. Hi. 
something you need? What's up, so? You need to show me something? Come on, let's go. Finish this up. All right. All right. Back to the game. You got washed laundry. Holding up the door. Holding the door open for me, are we? What a gentleman. Just letting in some fresh air and the sounds of the city. Hey, that's mine. Hurry up and get your things already. I already did. coming after us or not? I don't know. I thought he would. Let's pick a corner so we can ambush him from. What corner? It's all bushes. Then a shabby cart, very classy. Here, this tree will hide us nicely. What are you going to do if he just stays at the hotel? Well, I guess we'll just leave then. And he grows eyes in the back. We'll grow eyes in the back of our heads and keep watching over our shoulders all the times. Oh, what a pain! I can't believe I'm actually hoping he'll show up now. Good. Don't feel bad about murdering a murderer. And on that note, not th not it. You're making me do it again, dude. Only has a dude only has a knife. You got this. I hear footsteps, I think. Actually, wait, I never fired a gun. Crap. I think he stopped. I can't hear I can't hear anything anymore. You can't ambush a killer that's waiting to ambush you. You can't very well start looking for him either, not without letting him know that you're you know that he's here. Crap, did we whisper too loudly? Is he onto us? Why did he stop? To see what he's up to we're up to. Bad. This looks suspicious as hell. This does look like it doesn't look like anything. Well, you shouldn't even be able to see us from behind this. Yeah, I, an idea hits you then. Oh, you dirty boy! No, we can't do it here. Tiki, off I go. Come here and find me. I don't want to. Actually, seriously, I don't know what how this thing works. No peeking. You're Andrew. Why did she think of that? Time has come to play hide and seek with the with the killer and Ashley. Uh, do you want to die or is there something on you? Leave. <laughs> Here at all. Close, couldn't quite landing. Can you not let go of my hand, please?
Sophie, did you have grapes? Shoot! D is he dead? Nice work. Ashley claims her gun. Dude, you have to do the whole thing. I panicked. Go back. Go back. Uh, I guess so. I have no idea. I want to skip. I want to try again. <laughs> Load, load. We're gonna try, we're gonna load. We're gonna skip through basically pretty much all of it. I wanna try the other option, just shoot. All right, let's try again. work. Actually, I cleared her gun. <laughs> I knew you had it in you. See, that's a better option to get you to say bullets. I have a few choice words to say to you, but this is neither the time or the place. Let's get going before someone comes up and see us. Well then, we'll just sh can we just shoot them too? Don't think we always said be so lucky. Oh yeah, but what the fuck was that? What was what? Running off in the blue. What, you needed an excuse to start rummaging through the bushes? Now the hitman thought you were looking for me, he sat there waiting to kill you. He didn't know you had a gun and would kill him instead. I'm, at, I'm an absolute bloody genius. And what if he was in the bush you ran off to, huh? Genius. Well, he wasn't. Ugh. Quit your bitching, it all worked out. Clue me in next time and to have these genius ideas. So you can t I can tell you all. <laughs> Okay, you are now, you are Ashley. Do we just leave him here? Why not? As long as no one saw us do it, we're not going to get a clue who was. Is this? Well, this guy carries a knife with him. He's clearly a criminal. Maybe the authorities will assume his friends got hit with something. Ever the optimist. Eh, whatever. Let's just go oh, before someone comes in to walk their dog or something. Got car keys. Oh yeah, baby, leave your, your fingerprints all over the guy. That's just great. I'm sure you meant to say something else. I guess it doesn't matter since you've never gotten your fingerprints taken. Have you? Yeah. Ugh, motherfucker, what for? My driver's license? Well, good thing to me, manhandling this corpse then. All right, let's go. If see if this guy has anything interesting in his car. So much for not leaving fingerprints. It's a little late to worry about that. You've already touched the door, the handle, and the wheel. It's fine if it's me, right? Didn't mean to do that. There's an envelope with various papers inside. The most notable one reads, Dear Mr. Washing Machine, in consider this a receipt for clear cleaning services. We're extremely grateful for you to accept and clean our laundry for us, so we're confident in our, our services that you will not be needing any progress reports. In fact, please do not contact us. If anyone were to ask, 
The less we know, the better. As a bonus, we're including free samples of the new soda flavors from our sister company, Happy Washing. Are we the laundry? Seems that way. Ugh, yikes. Vroom vroom. So where to? Uh, could you elaborate? We're off somewhere, right? Got the car and everything now? This isn't exactly the best situation to go joyriding in a stolen car. We barely have enough money to feed us. Fine, let's go take mom's... Oh, fuck's sake. Does everything I say go oh, to one ear and out the other? We're never going to talk to anyone we, ever, we know ever again, remember? Did I say squat about talking to her? I... Let's go rob the bitch blind and leave. What money do you think she has exactly? I'm sure she's got something. I thought she inherited some jewelry from grandma. Yeah, well, she can't, we can't, she can't sell, but she can't sell those. She can't, but I sure can. Ah, uh, no, still can't go over there. Why not? We've got pursuers or something. Our parents' place is definitely something that they looked into. Listen, Andy. Wrong. Andrew, the pursuer, is taking a nap in the park right now. Do you honestly think we are anywhere near important enough for someone to hire you, hire to? If anything, it seems they assume that guy took care of us and that's and that's that. But the thing is, I'd rather be overly cautious than dead. Ugh. We'll be quick. Get in there, rob him, kill him, them, and get out. So now you want to kill our parents? Great. You just said we can't talk to them um, again anyway, and they might as well be dead. I was way, I, I'm way tired of, for this. Fine, we'll just rob them then. Break it in while they're at work, get some money, and get lost. I'll take it. Where do they live now anyway? I know the place, but I don't know what remember the exact address. She's already told. She actually told you the address. Yeah. Uh, the only thing she told me was to stop calling her. She probably figured I'd tell you then. Well, what's a sloppy job you did? Don't forgive me, Ashley. I didn't seem to be like relevant information at the time. Whatever, just drive. I haven't driven the car in over two years. We'll be fine. I just don't distract me or anything. Okie dokie. Feet on the door. Feet on the floor. Oh god, it's not even your car. Shut up and put your seatbelt on. Boo, this sucks. Yeah, yeah, it sucks. Now hurry up. What? What's that on your hand? You've gotten into something clearly. You did something without a permission again. You got a hold of paint again. Why do you do this? Where'd you even get this? No, no more. Hey, you gotta stop doing this, so. I'll be goddamn if we get caught in a dead man's car just because as you pulled over some st st for some um, stupid shit. Make me then. Do you do not want to get robbed? Do you do not want to go rob our parents? I said make me, Andy. Okay, do what you want. If it to piss me off, then you're nailing it right now. Oh, come on, it's just a joke. 
Now, I know it's not a joke. Oh yeah, it is. You get so mad. It's just funny. Like, I don't, don't know you, Ashley. You'll pull this shit. You've pulled this shit before. I have no idea what you're talking about. You keep going Andy, Andy, until I get, t I get tired of correcting you. And then suddenly it's Andy and Lele and the stupid bullshit all over again. Way to re eat into it. I always honestly just joking around. Well then, it's not funny and you're going to stop. Nothing is funny to you anymore. Well, are you going to drive or what? I just don't want to, us to get into trouble. But you don't have to be such a hard ass about it. I do though, and then you're such a dumb ass about it. Just drive. Are you angry? I'm looking out for us. Fucking drive, Andy. Drive, Andrew. And so he does, finally, and you decide I had to give Andrew the silent treatment until he apologizes. You're not sure if he needs to if he needs what he needs to apologize for exactly, but you won't forgive him until he does. So while you wait for him to notice you're not talking to him, you fall asleep. What the You're pretty sure you're dreaming. But at the same time you feel wide awake. soul or what who's there where are you where am I is this another vision or what there's no response there's nothing to step on What am I supposed to do here? red flowers. Her soul summit and you, you can't tune in. What are you all muffled? Old, I can't hear anything. Voice continues talking, but you can't make heads or tails. Uh, whatever, I should focus on getting out of here anyway. Okay, it wants me to go a certain direction. Okay. Fuck! Where am I? What? He looks the same. Lucky. Uh, it's you. I summoned you before, right? Human, you've come. Where am I? In a dream, I call you here. Well, you can wake me up then. I was in the middle of something. 
Doesn't even occur to you that you should be afraid of this soul stealing of this soul stealing creature? I have summoned you to make a deal. Great. What well, I can't do this right now. What if Andrew tries to talk to me? He needs to know that I'm def deliberately ignoring him instead of being in a coma or something. The human couldn't care less if the lover's spot at, pat at you've ha had with your brother. Having the lovers? It carries on as you ha hadn't said a thing. You've used my gift. What? What? Was it useful seeing the future? Ah, uh, yes. The trinket you gave me, yes. It's been useful. Thank you. Then do you want uh, to see the future again? Sure. I just have to keep holding on to it, right? It is out of energy. I'm able to recharge it. Do you want me to make a deal? Of course you do. Never has it been a bad idea to make deals with the devils. Let's hear it then. What do you want? Human souls. Well, I'm not getting... You're not getting mine, so if it... So if that it was it, then... Not yours. To our soul. Is that... Is that like an insult or... Then just anybody's. Why don't you just go get souls yourself? I cannot enter the human realm uh, um, unsummoned. Like you cannot re enter here. I am able to reach you only because of my I, of my talisman. But even then, one can only uh, interact between realms through deals. Do we have a deal? I don't really get it, but I can't say I'm all that interested either. Really, I really need to get back to my brother. Sorry, there's a cat trapped in here. Ah! Danny out. Sunny out. 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 Now. Jeez, is that hard to figure out? Ah. If I offer you a soul and make you'll make a talisman trinket it drink anything work again, right? Correct? Sounds good. Do I ha I do have a soul in t or two in mind actually. But I see what Andrew has to say about it. He's kinda I don't know, something is sh shifting and I something is shifting. I don't really like it. Demon says nothing to that. It probably wasn't the right identity to talk to about this. I'll be waiting. All right, I'll see what I can do. So n how do I wake up? You wake up once your your mind is returned to home. Uh, farewell, Tarsol. Entity is left. Pick up some flowers. Okay, I gotta get another flower. There's no returning.
Somewhere I thought there was a way to make Kennedy home. Oh my god, I'm so sick of these fucking flowers. Get me out of this shithole. Come on, wake up. It's not funny. I'm trying, jackass. Oh, God. Hair is what? I was a hair away from it taking you to the hospital. Oh, why? Why would you screw this over, wouldn't it? You wouldn't wake up no matter what I did. God, Ashley, don't scare me like that. Ugh, what time is it? Listen, like 10 in the morning or something? Mom and Dad shouldn't be you both at work right now. So, whatever, you're, you're ready, I guess. Okay, but being in, I say, you're only being nice because I, you treated me like shit last night. You tre I treated you the way you deserve to be treated. Oh, actually, no, scratch that. Considering you kept pushing me around all day, I think it was pretty fucking lenient with you. <sighs> So anyway, this episode is titled Andrew and Ashley, Home Sweet Home Invasion. What kind of knockoff trash grab show is that? I'm not interested. It's definitely all about the cash grabbing. <laughs> I mean, boo, no thank you. No, I saw that. You're into it. Let's go. No, it sucks. <laughs> but I'm so, so nice that I'll, I'll roll with it now. Why on earth are we some park? Free parking, that's why. Mom and Dad live somewhere down this slope. This can't be the right place. Look how nice everything is. Nah, it's gotta be this. She did sound happy when I talk she talked about her new place too. What's their last name anyway? What do you mean? What's their last name? The nameplate's on the doors. Did you go with Dad's... They do go with Dad's name or Mom's. Dad's name, right? Why would they change that at that point? I don't know. To throw us off? You really make it sound like they don't want us to find them. Just a feeling I got. Well, whatever. Let's find the house. Mr. and Mrs. Graves. Grayson. Shitterson. Jones. Ah, uh, here we go. Don't you just knock. No one comes to the door. All right, all good. Whatever, just find a way in. Oh, come on, look at this place. We got gardens and everything. Doesn't matter, we'll find our pockets and fill our pockets and go. Tasty onions, potatoes, palatable potatoes. One of the blanks is pet blanks is loose. Back doors locked. Oh, I think one of the windows is open. Can you reach it? Nope. Got a wooden plank. Place the wooden plank. All right. It's, ah, it's too high. Lift me up. Well, no good. It's open. The whole place by a latch is the other side of the window. Damn, my fingers can't reach the unhook it. We need the stick. Got a stick. Let's see. Let's see. Ha! Ah. Andrew helps you climb to the window. No, no. Give me your hand, I'll pull you up. Thanks, but I'll, I'd much rather just open the door for me. Oh yeah, that would be easier. Welcome, welcome, thank you. Not so fast. Now what do we say? Thank you very much. Wrong again, try again. Uh, wrong, try again. 
Exceptionally well done. That would have a shattering performance. Yes. To think they would open the door swiftly with such grace. Studying Marvel is breathtaking. Now, so your words by describing your ability to trespass. May I come in now? You may. What is with their egos? Then, let's split up. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Uh, hey, there's something I was wondering about. Right now? Can we wait? Our situation is kind of time sensitive. Yeah, well, it can, I guess. Good, then tell me later. Getting bored. A sink. Pot is empty. Coffee machine. Dresser is locked. Set the clothes. Let's see, toys is some rope. Close your closet. <laughs> Close the closet. <laughs> I want to know what your parents have been up to on this bed. Dresser is locked, so we need a key. Phone your mother never calls you with. Fireplace to have a goddamn fire boost, Andrew? Yes. This is some rich people stuff. Who has a fireplace inside their house? I'm not that uncommon, is it? Not the older houses, anyway. But this is... But is this a house old? Fuck if I know. Final letter it reads. Sorry to hear about what happened to your kids. I agree with Freddy Busting in disguise. Don't feel guilty. It's not your fault. The Lord has sorted it out for you. P.S. Since Andrew won't be finishing college, is there any chance that your daughter would ha have his textbooks? Those are ridiculously expensive. Thanks in advance. Much love to you and your husband. You never told me you dropped out. I didn't. I was just on pause until we got out of quarantine. Thought given the situation right now, I guess I, I did drop out. Well, tough luck to you for their daughter. Your textbooks are in ashes now. Here, the warm water comes out. This place has been abandoned. It feels. Notice they have any photos of us here? So what? I guess I'm a little offended. It's not like there were any pictures in general of our last place either. True, but another set. Um, why not both of us? Not us. Guess we're just too ugly to put it on display. Right. Maybe that's it. You're supposed to say I'm pretty. And you're supposed to be robbing the house. Get to it. Oh, there's a stairs. Parents have lived here for only a few months. I managed to hoard all this stuff in the spare bed and boot. Money is clearly no longer an issue. And an extra bed implies that there's no issue with their social life either. Cleaning supplies such as vinegar. Washing machine and a tumble dryer. Parents are living it up. Metal box full of screwdrivers. Take away some documents of purchasing a house. There's also a key. Dresser key. Christmas stuff with candles. Four drains of a clog. Um. Alright. There's mops and stuff, so let's go upstairs. He's in the he's not here. Found the key. Nice. What's in there? No sign of any jewelry, but you spot some paperwork. It reads, In your graves, we have opted for your compensation damages caused your company's error. Compens Glad to meet you. Please can to discuss that matter if you're the earliest convenience. Read through the folder. Something that I have. That's actually Andrew Graves. Huh. Huh? I didn't know we died three months ago. What the hell is this? I guess this explains why mom kept telling me not to call. It must have been spooky getting phone calls from a ghost. That's someone's entered the house. Oh shit, it's too early. They should have been home yet. 
instead of shooting shooting whichever parent just came in. You can't offer the soul of the dead, so you hold off the souls of the de dead, so you hold off for that idea. Is someone there? Hi, Mom, it's just us. Welcome home, Andrew. What are you doing here? Surprise, we came here for a visit. Oh, I see. How are you home so early? Did you get fired? It's my day off. I was going out, just out shopping. How did you two get inside? You left the door unlocked. You should really be more careful than that. Did I really? Here, let me help you with these groceries. Thanks. You should have let me know when you were coming. How about some coffee? Where do you keep the grounds? It's in the top cover, but what about the quarantine? Any milk in yours? Sure, let me just go wash my face. What the hell are you doing? Just play along for now, please. Guess I'll make some coffee. Just putting up the way the groceries. Probably some coffee. Oh shit, I've skipped too much text. What do you care? Well, first we got evacuated. After that, we gave us a go ahead to leave since we've been cleared for the parasites anyway. Huh, interesting. On the news, they said you and everyone died. Well, would, that would certainly make us the story sell more. Anyway, we go here now. Neither burnt nor full of parasites. I was glad you're safe. Yeah, you sure look like it. So, uh, quite the upgrade from your previous place, huh? Where'd you get the money for this place? Did you finally win the lottery? Huh, I wish. The house needs some serious repairs, but the area's worth it, don't you think? Perfect non-answer. They even hold barbecue events here for our na with our neighbors. Barbecue events, just like on TV. I thought it was some bullshit, but no, they actually do that stuff here. Bet you stick out like a sore thumb. You'd be surprised, I'm actually quite well-liked. Though it's probably all thanks to my cooking skills. It's a shame I actually didn't inherit any. Hey, what the hell? <laughs> the rest of the conversation is dreadfully boring. You don't contribute any, anything to it because you can't keep up with Andrew's lies. And if you're being honest, you just don't oh, want to talk to your mother in the first place. All is good in seeing you. The father should be coming home soon, so we really need to start making some dinner. Oh no, don't worry about it, I'll make something. You know full well that that was her or way of telling you to get lost. Oh boy, I can't wait to hear how Dad has been. Must have been all kinds of stories about repairing this place. That's true. Anyway, you don't go, why don't you go oh, rest? I'll fix something. Uh, something. <sighs> I'll take you up on that, thank you. Mother leaves. You are Andrew. I have a feeling that Ashley is going to do something. Somehow your burglary attempt ended up with the cooking your victim's dinner. Go ahead then. Make something, you smooth talker, you. I'm going to have to save and play another time. So, I'll see you guys at another time. So, bye bye